Windows 101. Windows Styles. Literally thousands of combinations are available to explore, allowing homeowners to create just about any window opening style in their home, or to replace just about any existing opening with an attractive update with improved functionality. But even with all of the available choices, most windows fall into a handful of style types. In many areas of the country, the most popular style is the double hung. These windows have a top and a bottom sash. Each section operates to allow for ventilation and usually tilts in for easy cleaning of the exterior pane. Given the popularity of the double hung window, most manufacturers offer two or three price points to allow homeowners to determine the best overall value for their needs. By comparison, the single hung window has a top sash that is fixed. The bottom sash will slide up and down, but may or may not tilt in. Bottom sashes on single hungs that do not tilt may still be removed for cleaning, however. These are called side load single hungs, and with the two tabs engaged along either side of the upper jam, the sash may be easily removed and placed back. Horizontal sliders are more common in openings that are wider in nature. A two light slider has two sashes and either one or both will slide open. A three light slider may have a third sash in the middle that is fixed. These models are typically used in larger openings that exceed the recommended square footage of a two light model. Casement and awning windows are frequently categorized as hinged windows due to the way each opens like a door and both open to the outside. Both of these window types use a crank to open and close the sash. Casement windows open along vertical hinges like a door while awning windows open along horizontal across the top of the sash. Casement windows may be ordered as large multiple units in one frame. For example, a five light casement will have five casement windows that may or may not operate all in one master frame. A single or even a twin casement is the ideal style over a kitchen sink as it can be easily opened by a crank in the lower corner as opposed to reaching across the sink and counter to slide open a top or bottom sash. Awning windows are typically stacked over each other or an opening may have a fixed light or a picture window stacked over the awning at the bottom. A hopper window or basement hopper looks a lot like an awning window but is usually found in a basement or cellar near the ceiling. From the home's exterior, these windows are located just above the ground. Due to its location close to ground level and that they usually tilt into the house, a hopper window usually has two operating mechanisms that lock or unlock the window for increased security. A mold unit simply refers to multiple units of a similar style that have been attached. A twin double hung is two double hungs that have been joined to form one mold unit. A triple would be three double hungs joined together. A transom is a picture window placed above another window or door. This may be mold to the unit below it or it may be in its own opening separated by a narrow portion of the wall. Usually vertical in design, a side light is a picture window that is adjacent to either side of a door. Special shapes may also be referred to as geometrics or architectural shapes. Regardless of the name, these styles are created in a variety of shapes and sizes. Some of these may actually have an opening sash, but most designs are created in fixed light fashion as picture windows. Shapes are often molded to other windows or installed adjacent to other windows to create a dramatic window wall. Projection windows are just that. They project outward and are typically available in garden, bay, or bow configurations. A garden window is one you find over a kitchen sink or as a bathroom window with glass top panels and flanking side lights with optional shelves for frames or potted plants. Bay windows are always three lights, two flanker windows that are each half the width of the center window. The two flanker windows are usually double hung or casement styles, and the center unit is almost always a fixed picture window. Bow windows, by comparison, are equal sized lights in three, four, or five light combinations. The flankers are also probably double hung or casement windows, but could be fixed picture windows the same as the central lights. You may see a two light bow window every once in a while, but very few manufacturers produce these anymore. A bay or bow window will normally include a cable system to help support it. The seat board is also included and may be upgraded for enhanced thermal performance or to add a richer wood grain for aesthetic reasons. However, in most cases, the roof system is not included, so make sure that the cost of a complete unit is provided. In some regions, you may find less common window types, like jealousy windows, which are made of multiple horizontal panes of glass that tilt similar to window blinds. Popular in mild climates are sunroom windows. Tilt and turn windows do just that. 
they tilt in with one mechanism or they turn in with another operator. These may be found in more urban, like commercial applications. Some homeowners who replace their windows simply want a newer version of what they already have. Others will want to know what alternatives are available to add value or style to their home's appearance and energy efficiency. Knowing what is available and when to suggest a casement window over a kitchen sink or a four light bow window to replace an old large aluminum slider are signs of not just a good salesperson, but of a trained window consultant who contributes expertise to the selling and presentation process. We hope this makes understanding windows and all of their styles a little easier.